use third-party tools for cost optimization. Now, I just told you to start with the native tools, and I still say start with the native tools. But there is an area of third-party tools where they really do shine, and I would say that's where it comes to cost optimization, to governance. They really do a good job. The third-party tools will be able to give you the same capabilities if you're choosing the right tool across multiple cloud providers. What we're looking for here is a tool that is constantly assessing the way that we're using the cloud provider and is able to constantly give us good recommendations on what changes we can make to gain this cost optimization that we're looking for. We're also looking for a tool that can um, alert us, that can enforce governance. For example, things as basic as a tagging strategy. I wanna be able to know if there's an asset, if there's a resource that got created on any of the cloud providers that doesn't have a tag associated with it. Um, the third-party tools that can enforce that, it's even better if they can prevent that uh, asset from being created without a tag, then even better. Now, the, the, the native tools, you're able to do that using policies and, and a variety of other ways. But again, these are the types of things. This is the area that if you were to ask me, if I were to consult with you, I would strongly recommend a third-party tool when it comes to cost optimization and governance. When it comes to provisioning and management, uh, there we have to have a little more of a conversation. 